Joint statement by Department of Telecommunications and Unique Identification Authority of India clarifying that the news of the 50 crore mobile numbers at risk of disconnection is completely untrue. Further, in the light of the SC verdict, if anybody wishes to get her KYC, um, uh, his or her Aadhaar KYC replaced by the fresh KYC, he or she may request the service provider for delinking her Aadhaar by submitting fresh OVDs as per the earlier DOT circulars. Aishwarya Paliwal joining us on the phone line. Aishwarya, can you break it down for us? There's a lot of information coming in on the clarification that has been issued by DOT and UIDAI on disconnection matters. Over to you. Yes, this is a clarification that has come and it's a joint press statement by the Department of Telecommunications as well as the UIDAI. Now, they are saying that there have been certain reports which have surfaced which say that close to 50 crore mobile numbers would be shut down, but they are saying that this is not true. They are saying that uh, going ahead, both uh, UIDAI and Department of the DOT would make sure that uh, people get their SIM card and Aadhaar would not be compulsory. They also, they also went ahead and said that in the joint statement, the Honorable Supreme Court said that Aadhaar was directly related, linked to the mobile numbers, but this could also be done through eKYC. And they also said in the, in the statement, the Supreme Court clarified that all those numbers which have been linked to the Aadhaar should not be disconnected. So right. the statement clearly saying that hmm. people should not panic. There should be no panic. None of those disconnection reports are true. So uh, that sets the record straight. Thanks for joining us, Aishwarya, with your inputs.